Breaking here at 5 o'clock, a Metro Schools teacher is in trouble for animal cruelty for a second time this year now, after the school's emu died. Yeah, that's a flightless bird that looks like an ostrich. News 4's Rebecca Cardenas is live at McGavick High School. Rebecca, they have an agriculture program and multiple exotic animals have died under one teacher's care this year. Yeah, Tom, that's why Animal Control was out here last week. Several of the school's alpacas died in the spring, so Animal Control was paying a surprise checkup to this barn here at the school where they keep the animals, and they noticed that conditions had worsened, and the emu, the school's emu, was looking very thin. They recommended to the teacher the emu be taken to a vet to be looked at, and to Animal Control's notion, that never happened. Today, the teacher reported to Animal Control that the emu had died. Now, we spoke to her, the teacher, in the spring after she was cited for animal cruelty for not providing the alpacas food and water overnight like it was recommended to her by animal control. Even though it is really sad and we have to talk about how um, it would be great if we can prevent some of these preventable issues in the future, you know, it's, it's they learn just as much when something bad happens as when something good happens. Now, the strange part of this story is that there, no one has been able to determine how the emu died to our knowledge. A vet has not been able to see it. Animal Control says that the school has not been able to tell them where the emu is now in order for a vet to see it. Metro Schools has not been able uh, to answer our answer or our answer to the same question, although they did tell us that another teacher will be taking over this class.